What the f I'll catch you in the morning. You have got to be kidding me. We are going. This one's for you, Dad. Yes, good morning. It's Sunday out here, sorry about the wind, but today I'm climbing that mountain. There should be a little weather window this afternoon. I'm going to pack my stuff after this. Just getting a last run in for the week. Get the kayak and I'm summiting that mountain. So happy Sunday. Let's get this going. All right, I think we are ready to go. Kayak is packed. I have everything I need, tents and mats and food and everything. So water is not looking too bad out here at the moment. That is where I'm heading up there. So let's tackle this first. I can see here it's starting to break up. Fingers crossed. The wind that's coming in, I think it is a southerly breeze. So I'm kind of shielded by this little uh, island at the moment. So it looks good here seen a few fishing boats out as well and that is always a very very good sign so i'm gonna get in chuck you on the chest mount let's get over to this other island i think that's gonna do us i cannot wait for this one honestly everything is there that's that's good don't step on the oar look at this weather look at this weather let's go think boom 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 that's closed look at this look at this look at that the wind the wind's chilling out the clouds are breaking up this is what i'm talking about weather window weather window out here in norway no one uses the time everyone just fishes and hikes according to the weather now this thing feels very heavy so fingers crossed i'm not going under ah oh, look at this this is just gonna get out of control this is just gonna get out of control Come on, bud. Let's go. This is us. Let me get into this beast. Yo! -ho! All right. We are setting out. We are in. <laughs> Let's go. All right. Water looks okay still. A few little waves. Nothing too serious. <laughs> We are going. I wonder how far it is. How far do we reckon that is, huh? I can feel it coming in the air tonight. Hold on. Keep going. Woohoo! All right, we were scouting this out yesterday. I think I know which way to get up. And we should be good to just park the kayak in here. My main man, Frude, showed me the ways yesterday. So we are listening to Frude. Brah, look at that. It's nice and green and grassy. It's not too windy out here. Come on, buddy, go to the island. We are about to set foot on this untouched beast. Woohoo! I do have me big boots on so I can tackle any of this water. Look at this. Let's get out of this beast. Socks are a bit wet, that's all good. Let's just get you up out of the water on these slippery ass rocks. The Green Machine 2.0, carrying the Green Machine 1.0. That's living. That's where we came from out there. I don't know if you could see the lighthouse, but I could see it and I can see some very, very nice colors. So let's get in and let's get hiking. Green Machine squared, hey? Now I think it is low tide. So I'm gonna bring 2.0 and just rest it up here. But I mean, come on, come on, come on. Look at this thing in front of me. This is just gonna be outrageous.
we are all packed ready to go i didn't want to drag this across the rocks but it is way safer up here not too sure what the tide's doing and i don't need that living rent free in my head whilst i'm up here hiking so let's get the legs moving and get to the peak There's a little bit more colour out here over the water. I mean, the Norwegians, like the fishermen, everyone here just lives by the weather. It's crazy. Like, if you're getting a good weather window on Sunday into Monday morning, you're calling up boss man and being like, sorry, I gotta sleep on top of a mountain tonight. Can I please come in tomorrow, work some extra hours? Cause it's gonna be a banger sunset. Need to get me drone in the air. Have an east bound on the top of this mountain. No one else here. You can't say no to that. So that's kind of how it works around here. Just go with the weather. So keep on going, eh? That's where I live. <laughs> if that's not the best home in the world, then I don't know what is honestly now i haven't been back on the trails i got about 60 k's in over the last sort of eight days back in the elevation i'd be lying if i didn't say that this was giving me a bit of a burn but we're training for that arctic triple 48 k's two weeks away let's go but I think this is where I'm gonna camp for the night. Have a look at this. <laughs> the sun's starting to break through as well. <laughs> Have a look at this. Cheers. Look at this, got the East Bjorn. This one comes from the Vardens Nordligaste Bryggeri, the world's most northern brewery. Fun fact, got the pizza tonight. I mean, just sitting here, taking it in, in the green machine. We're a bit uneven tonight, but that does not matter. And today I was thinking on this mission, just the conversation I had with my dad back in January. And I said, Dad, I'm a bit unsure what to do. Should I get an electrical job and stay in Sydney or should I take what I have and go see the world? And he said, Eddie, you're in your mid twenties, go see the world, son. And to hear that from someone who has been through what no human being should ever go through, he's the biggest inspiration to me. This one's for you, Dad. I love you, I miss you, and yeah, I hope you're well. Cheers.
pizza on top of the mountain, baby. Who else has got pizza up on the top of this mountain? Absolutely no one, because I'm the only one on this island, baby. No one else is drinking beer and pizza up here. <laughs> Good night. I'm going to get a couple hours sleep in. I'll catch you in the morning. Good morning. Let me... It's just gone after 2 a.m. in the morning. Look at this. Bro, there's no way I'm sleeping. Let's get out there. Look at that. Yo, just whipped up. First cup of coffee for the day. Still a little bit windy, but that sunrise is just... <laughs> What's the time? Let me just check real quick. The time is 2.48, 2.48 a.m. And that sunrise is just like something I've never seen. I'm gonna get out there and drink this. Cheers. Camp is packed up and it's 3.50 in the morning. That just sounds crazy, but it was a little bit uneven here last night. I slept in kind of like some groove, so it wasn't too bad, but yeah, it's it's gotten a little bit warmer. So it was about seven, eight degrees last night, which is so much better than what it has been recently. I wasn't even that cold. Look at this sun. This is just incredible. I'm on my way back down to grab the kayak. There's a bit of sparky work going on over on this island today. Maybe head into the mainland, who knows? But all I can say is it's honestly cheat code up here with this light. Gets semi-dark around midnight, maybe a little bit before, and then 2 a.m. it's already light again. Just seen a big fishing vessel go out there. I'm heading down the mountain. This is just, what a spot. Ah, what a spot, what a spot, what a spot. See you soon. I definitely came down a way more sketchy way. <laughs> but look at these clouds and that island. Little island lighthouse, baby, let's go. Yo, -ho! green machine 2.0, what is doing? All right, so it's gone 4.30. We still have lots of time. No stress on these islands is the go. So I was told before coming here that there's some sort of island, no, there's some sort of beach around this corner. So I'm gonna leave all my stuff here, take my camera, go for a Monday morning jog and see what's around this corner. So come with. Bro, look at these trails. Are you kidding me? All right, just stopping in here real quick. We are on Galkve Oya, however you pronounce that. And it says here that the first written sources can be tracked to 1450. That's just insane. I slept up here last night, 273 meters of elevation above sea level. Kwer Din Stas Tinden, however you pronounce that. So I came in here on my kayak, parked up there, hiked up here, camped there. Now I've come back down and now we're running this stretch here. I think I'm about halfway and I'm on my way to Sandholmen. Look at that crispy blue water and white sand. Let's go. Good morning, Galkwe. <laughs> 
You have got to be kidding me! Look at this! <laughs> Perfect green grass spot for a fire pit there. Look at this! I honestly have no words. I just don't understand how this place keeps delivering. I'm gonna get back to this kayak before I stay here forever. Oh, mate. Green Machine 2.0 is ready to go. The water out here, hopefully we don't get chopped by any fishing boats. And then, yeah, that should be successful mission. So let's get back to uh, the other island. <laughs> hard to get into oh, what the fuck there we go far out don't know what i was trying to do before all right let's go if we can get off this rock the water was actually surprisingly nice to swim in it was cold but very refreshing little island eh? what a perla All right, we have made it back. I honestly cannot believe what I have just done. Grassy ridgeline camp with amazing weather down to a morning sunrise swim at a crispy blue watered white sand beach. Like, you gotta be joking me. I'm gonna go pack this away. Oh, and just debrief for a minute. So hit like, hit subscribe if you do enjoy this stuff. I want to keep making it. I had so much fun. So yeah, as always, I'll catch you in the next one and hopefully it's as good as this. So yeah, cheers and have a good one.